I'm sorry, Miss Walker, but chasing you around that bridge was more exhausting than I thought. That's okay. I can wait. Ah, nonsense. I know how eager you are to find out about Dana. So you go first. I'll meet you at Section 08. I'll come meet you there. Okay, then. And don't forget, miss. Section 08. Find it, and I'll meet you there. Oof. Cold as hell here. How the heck do I get myself into these situations? There's something sinister about all this. Have no fear, Kate Walker. The sun's setting, and you're all alone in an isolated and derelict place. Statistically speaking, it is highly improbable that you'll meet anybody, good or bad. Thank you, Oscar, but please do me a favor. Stop trying to reassure me, would you? As you wish, Kate Walker. Grim. This place gives me the creeps. Looks like... Oh, jeez. What is it, Kate Walker? This place, it's... it's a cemetery, Oscar. I think Dana's... Oh my god, she must have... Don't jump to hasty conclusions yet, Kate Walker. You should try and find that spot that Colonel Blake mentioned. Section 08. Yes, I... Okay, let's go. Oh my god. Section 08 is over there. I don't have time to get lost in that maze. 
I'm gonna need you to be my eyes, Oscar. Will do. Just call me whenever you need directions. Section B. Something's missing here. It seems to have to do with the gates. Section F. Ugh, it's not here. I need directions. Undertakers must store their tools in it. I need directions, Oscar! Reporting for duty, once again. Illegible. The Undertakers must have forgotten it. recognize some of the names here. Pretty interesting. But I should get back to what I was doing. I need your eyes, Oscar! All right, then. The inscription has faded away.
What? What happened? Dana's health had deteriorated at the Santorium. Her coughing fits, the pregnancy, and all the stress about Leon being on the run out there in Baltayar. It was just too much for her to bear. The doctors had to put her to sleep before her delivery. There were complications, and when she woke up... Her parents told her the terrible news. They had already buried the baby girl. How come the Brown Shadow didn't go after Dana? They controlled Ostertal back then, right? Oh, they would have eventually, believe me. And afterwards? Dana became sterile because of the complications during childbirth. So she remained at the sanatorium a few months more. She was devastated, poor darling. That's how she survived the pogroms. Yes, but that didn't mean she was safe. So what happened afterwards? Dana lost everything. Her parents, her baby, Leon. I think she would have just given up if I hadn't been there that day. But I had to go to London. Back then, I used to get invited every year or so to all kinds of artistic events. I could then make out my report to the British Secret Service without arousing the Brown Shadow's suspicion. So I took Dana with me to save her from them. 